All right, just coming into view right now is CSL Whitefish. Uh, she's come down from Sault Ste. Marie and she's making her way up to Quebec. Uh, she's just approaching Port Coburn. She's about five kilometers away from Port Coburn right now. Um, that's where I'm sitting. Just about, I'm about four kilometers away and that's getting closer to me now. So gonna get the drone up very shortly. Uh, the winds are nice and light. So I think we're about to get some drone shots today. So uh, let's have a good look at the CSL Whitefish. This is the CSL Canada Steamship Lines Whitefish Bay and she was built at the Xingyi Shipyard at Yingyan, China. It was constructed and launched in 2013 as part of the Canada Steamship Lines fleet of self-unloading bulk carriers. The vessel is a third of the CSL's Trillium class of ships. Her sister ships are the Bay Como, Bay St. Paul and Thunder Bay. Similar to other vessels in the CSL's fleet, the CSL Whitefish Bay is primarily involved in transporting bulk commodities such as iron ore, coal, grain, and it operates on the Great Lakes and St. Lawrence Seaway, connecting ports in Canada and the United States. Whitefish Bay achieved an historic safety milestone by operating for four operational years in the Great Lakes and St. Lawrence Seaway system without a single lost time incident, an LTI. It's an impressive feat for this reliable vessel. So how did she measure up? Well, the ship is 225.5 meters in length, which is 739 feet and 10 inches. Uh, and the beam is 23.76 meters, which is 77 feet and 11 inches. And the gross tonnage of the vessel is 24,430.
All right, there you have it, Whitefish Bay. Don't know what they just said, but anyway, Whitefish Bay, heading into Port Coburn, making its way downbound on the Welland Canal, out to Lake Ontario, and up to Quebec. So there you have it. Hope you enjoyed the video. There is another ship coming in, but I can't stick around for that because uh, the Euros are on. Got to get home, watch the game. I've got 45 minutes to get home, get this uh, out of the water and get home. So anyway, uh, until the next video, stay safe, take care, take care, see you soon.